Hi guys, I'm Tracy with Tracy's Fancy and I'm a Dixie Belle brand ambassador coming to you today to give you a very brief description of one of my favorite products, which is the Patina Collection. You may be overwhelmed because there's a lot to choose from, but let me tell you, it's really quite easy. There's just three different paints to choose from, iron, copper, and bronze. In addition to that, you will need two, one of the two sprays or you can use them both together, blue and green. It's that simple. There is a primer and there is a sealer, but we'll talk about that in a second. If I were to choose to use a green spray, and I chose green spray over copper paint, these are the three looks that I would get. This is green spray over copper. This is green spray over bronze. And this is green spray over iron. All three of these give a completely different look. This is the original. Very glossy, straight out of the factory. These all look very aged, worn, very authentic. Even the two darks have a very different look. Whoops, flip that around. They have a very different look. This is much more believable, don't you think? So that is simple, right? I have got a board right here that I'm happy to share with Dixie Belle. I will have them post. This is every single color that you can get from every single spray and combining the two of them together. Real quick, I'm gonna show you. Right here behind me is the piece that I've painted in my own home. And this right here is sort of a blue-green color. It is used, it's copper paint with both blue and green spray. I did that as well on my own um, hardware in my kitchen cabinets. And this is the look that I got right here. It's a blue-green color, very different from the green spray. This is bronze with green spray. This is bronze with blue-green spray. So do you see every single time you're gonna get a different look? So if you're a control freak, leave that control at the door because you need to just enjoy the experience. So I'm gonna take the camera down a little bit and I'm gonna show you exactly how to do this to get the best results. You wanna take your, your project, whether it's a piece of hardware or a furniture, I'm gonna dip this into my bronze paint. I do want to tell you that it's very, very important um, once you have used your paint with your brush, if you've already used reactive spray, do not re-dip into your paint because your paint in your jar will begin to react and you'll ruin it. It will ruin that way. So you wanna put one coat on just like that, nice and simple. I find that if I, if I blot it on like this, it sort of gives it an added texture and that's a lot more for the reactive spray to grab onto. You wanna sit, you wanna let this dry for, it takes about 30 minutes if you're in a climate controlled area. As soon as it's dry, you wanna do your second coat. You'll go back into the same color paint, re-dip it, paint it on like that, set it down, and then you wanna take your green spray or your blue spray, or both at the same time, which is what I'm gonna do here, and we're gonna spray this at the same time. I just aim and spray, just like that. Then you let it sit and you wanna give it about six hours to get yourself a full-blown reaction. About six hours. It's that simple, guys. You can do that on furniture, you can do it on glass, you can do it on tile, you can do it on pottery, you can do it on your hardware. Whatever you wanna do, go for it. Leave your, uh, leave your control mechanisms at home. Just be excited about the results that you get. And um, then in the end, you want to seal it with a patina guard. This has actually been sealed with a patina guard here. Lightly brush it on. It's not always necessary, but it just makes it a little bit more hardy. This here does not get touched or used, and it's actually not been patina guarded. These have because they're hardware. So um, I hope that that helps you. I hope that you will enjoy this process as much as I do. Paint once, let dry, paint twice, and spray immediately. Watch it, get excited, that's it. Thanks so much, you guys.